So let's now extend this application and add two more new services. We're going to add a processor service here, which is written in Node and does a sentiment analysis on the tweet. And we have another service here, which is written in Go, which is a viewer service that displays the results in a UI. If we go look at the provider service here and open up its app.js, you'll see that we've added a published content service and a score sentiment service. So just as before, we received tweets on the tweets endpoint from the compo Twitter component in our components folder. But this time for each tweet, we're going to call the sentiment analysis service, then save its content and then publish it to the UI using a published content. So how do we do that? Very straightforward. We take advantage of the building blocks of Dapper. So here we can call onto the service endpoint, we can call the invoke method for the sentiment score method on the processor service here. So equally, we can take advantage of, as we did before, saving state into our tweet store. And also we can use to take advantage of the publish building block in order to send a processed tweet. If we look at the sentiment score service, just like before, this is as simple as calling a post message onto an endpoint uh, which is set up on the process service. So let's go and look at that method. If we open up the processor service and we open up its app.js, you'll see here, here's the sentiment score service that we can call. So this is doing direct service to service invocation using Dapper. Dapper is doing all the hard work of calling from the provider service to the processor service for you onto the sentiment score method. And the sentiment score method here takes advantage of Azure Cognitive Services. Equally, if I go back to the, the provider here, you'll see that after I've called a sentiment service here, I'm now going to call on publish the content. And publish content method here, just as before, does a post message here, but this post this time is posting a pub subtopic, taking advantage of uh, Redis as a state store using the publish building block of Dapper. Well, how does it do that? Inside the provider here, there's a component here for a pub sub Redis state store. Uh, called processed and equally inside our viewer service inside here if I open up the viewer service inside its components folder here it too has a pub sub component which is identical and receives messages for the process tweets on its UI so let's go and run this application I actually already have um, two of the services up and running already I have the viewer service and I have the processor service up and running here so I'm just going to simply launch the provider service here now this time I'm running it in node so I'm doing dapper run node app.js with the name of the uh, application so when I run this it'll start up it'll start receiving tweets the provider application hooks together calling first onto the sentiment analysis processor service and when that gets back it then sends the results through a processed topic so here's all the tweets coming in you'll see here if I actually go and look at the processor service these are them being scored with their sentiment analysis inside here so i'm just going to stop the provider here a moment just as before if i refresh the redis state store you'll see here all the tweets that are being saved just like we saw in our earlier application but also you'll see here that i'm taking advantage of redis as a pub sub provider so i'm processing sending all of the processed topics between the provider into the viewer service and as a result of all of this if I switch over to my viewer service here, which is running locally, you'll see all of the tweets here that are displayed in my UI with their sentiment analysis, whether they're negative, positive, or neutral. So this shows how straightforward it is for me to build out an application, how I can put a, take advantage of the building blocks now using simple HTTP calls, either for doing direct method invocation on another service, saving state, or using the published published building block in order to send a topic between two services.